see death go on singing over my head, I see freedom in there. And then we would be thrown into paddy wagons, and sometimes we were stacked in there like sardines in a can. They would throw us in, and old bull would say, take them off. And they did, and we would just go on in the paddy wagon singing, we shall overcome. And every now and then we'd get in jail, and we'd see the jailers looking through the windows, being moved by our prayer, and being moved by our words and our song. And there was a power there which Bull Connor couldn't adjust, adjust to. And so we ended up transforming Bull into a steer, and we won our struggle in Birmingham. <laughs> now we've got to go on in Memphis just like that. I call upon you to be with us when we go out Monday. Now about injunctions. We have an injunction and we're going into court tomorrow morning to fight this illegal, unconstitutional injunction. All we say to America is be true to what you said on paper. If I lived in China or even Russia or any totalitarian country. Maybe I could understand some of these illegal injunctions. Maybe I could understand the denial of certain basic First Amendment privileges because they haven't committed themselves to that over there. But somewhere I read of the freedom of assembly, somewhere I read of the freedom of speech, somewhere I read, of the freedom of press, somewhere I read that the greatness of America is the right to protest for rights. And so just as I say we aren't going to let any dogs a water hoses turn us around, we aren't going to let any injunction turn us around. Well, I don't know what will happen now. We've got some difficult days ahead. But it really doesn't matter with me now, because I've been to the mountaintop. I don't mind. Like anybody, I would like to live a long life. Longevity has its place. But I'm not concerned about that now. I just want to do God's will. And he's allowed me to go up to the mountain. And I've looked over. And I've seen the promised land. I may not get there with you. But I want you to know the night that we as a people will get to the promised land. So I'm happy tonight. I'm not worried about anything. I'm not fearing any man. Mine eyes have seen the glory of the coming of the Lord.